You know, every day I receive an email from someone that doesn't believe that God loves them anymore. As if God could stop. My friend, the Bible contains a repeated promise over and over again that God's love endures forever. We read those words, and yet we don't believe that that pertains to us. Well, every word pertains to you. It's a promise in the Bible and in spiritual life that you can rely upon. God's love, it does not depend on your status. It doesn't depend on your behavior. I know I've heard some sermons where they say it does, but not according to the Bible, not according to Jesus Christ. Your thoughts do not affect God's love for you, it affects your awareness of God, but not God for you. And your past does not keep you back from the love, the encouragement, the wisdom of God. God loves you simply because you are God's creation, made in God's image, and always close to God's heart. C.S. Lewis has said, through our feelings, they come and go, but God's love through us does not. And in Psalms 103, verses 17 and 18, the Bible says, The love of the Lord remains forever with those who love God. God's salvation extends to the children's children, of those who are faithful to God's covenant, of those who obey God's commandments. Have you today opened your heart to God? Have you sincerely asked God to rule over your day and your life? God promises to bless you with God's peace and God's abundance. Today, and every single day, take comfort in this, knowing that for you, God's love endures forever. Remember that God's love for you is perfect. It is unending. And be assured that God's love is attended, intended for you, God's child. And I close by saying, God bless you. And God will, because God loves you.